without you telling me, I know that you're trying to find your solution to whatever fitness goal you have by doing two things. You're trying to increase exercise, either you're increasing di uh, duration, intensity, number of days. I mean, you're trying to maximize as many calories as you can burn through exercise. The other thing you're trying to do is you're trying to eat as less as possible because you've been told that, that food is your enemy, that you have to cut down on your calories. And that is unfortunately the only method we know that has been handed down to us generation through generation that if you lose weight, you exercise to increase uh, and that I can tell you, I've been in the industry for 20 years and I've been constantly educating myself not to flaunt it but to give you a perspective that lots of things have changed in the industry but unfortunately, we don't know what to do with So what am I trying to say? I'm just trying to say that eating less and exercising more is not the answer. What is the answer is a combination of two things. Number one, you have to take a mind and body approach. You can't leave the mind behind and just work on the body. You know, you're getting anxiety attacks, you're stressed out all the time, and you're just training in the gym thinking, Ji, is this kuch theek ho jayega? the endorphin rush and all of that is there. But if you're not mentally training yourself, uh, along with the body, you're doing half the work. Number two, you have to take uh, four things into consideration. Number one, improve your nutrition, uh, improve the quality of your food and stop counting calories. Number two, meet your nutritional deficiencies, which means that the vitamins we don't eat like vitamin D3, magnesium and so forth, that you have to fulfill. Number three, learn to manage stress at the basic level. And then the fourth number is exercise, aati hai, smart exercise. Not excess or a lot of exercise, but smart exercise. So if you keep these things in mind, and if you learn to evolve, then only and only then can you make progress. Now, but the hard part is, is she's going to accept karna because I speak to a lot of people and they're like, what the hell are you saying, Adnan? It doesn't make sense. I mean, you're telling me that the way to lose weight is not by exercising more and eating less. It can't be true. I ask you, this is a hadith that we have to follow. Okay, so open your mind. Lots of things have changed. If you, if you give yourself the opportunity to accept something new, only then can you make progress. Hope this video makes sense. Have a great weekend. Bye-bye.